All right, welcome to day two continued how to get free traffic. In this section, we're going to cover how to create free leads and get more traffic. And it's very important a topic to spend a lot of time on and get this right because it will determine how much money you make. So you really want to make sure that you get this nailed down. And so I spend a lot of time talking about traffic. And there's a lot of things you can do. So that's the good news. We're going to go over lots of tips and hacks and tools in this section. This is a really fun um, section. All right, so let's get into it. First thing we're going to do is go to something called TikTok Sort Tool. Okay, so we want to use this tool called Sort for TikTok to help us find viral videos that have done really well. And we're going to use the same hook lines and the same words, but we're going to put our own spin on the video. So we're going to take from the video a little bit, like a few key words, like train loose leash walking in 15 minutes. So let's say for this example, you're in dog training. you got a dog product to sell. You want to know which dog videos have done the best. So I simply searched for dog training in the TikTok toolbar, toolbar and looked for all kinds of videos that came up. And I'm looking for the videos that have done the best. So a couple came right up right here at the top here. What we want to do is maybe take a look at this guy's account. He had 5 million views with this account with this video. So we want to see all the videos that he's made. So I'm going to go to his account. Okay. And he's got videos that have done well, but it's hard to find them. So we're going to sort uh, with the sort tool. So I'm going to hit sort for TikTok. Okay. And I'm going to show you how to download it in a second. So we just hit start. Now he, it instantly downloaded or start, sorted every video in his account from best views to worst. So all the top views are all the top videos are right at the top here. So now I can instantly see, okay, in my dog niche, this type of these type of videos have done the best. This hook line, train loose leash walking in 15 minutes. This mistake, uh, see new puppy owners, uh, train a perfect heel. So I would recreate all these videos with my own hook line, put my own spin on it, maybe put my own dog in the video or whatever. Or if I didn't have a video of a dog, uh, we would use other footage and I'll show you how to do that in a second. So that, and that, and you can do that for any niche. You can do it for fitness. You can do it for keto, anything, relationships. So if I hit keto, I look for the best keto videos. And this guy, there's, here's a good one. This guy, Chef Michael. Uh, so I look at his uh, channel and I want to find all his best videos. So I'm going to sort for TikTok. Boom. And it shows me instantly uh, that pesto chicken was really popular. So I would make a video about pesto chicken. I would make a video about cucumber salad and creamy, uh, what's that say? Creamy lemon chicken and so on. And you get the idea. Okay, so how to download that that tool. You just go to your, bra your uh, browser extensions, your Chrome extensions, okay? Go to the top here and just type sort for TikTok and then you can download it. So going back to the notes here, let's move a mobile app called InShot. Okay, it's, uh, it helps me make a lot of my videos. I use maybe 50, 60% of the time I will make videos and edit videos on my phone and then upload them to TikTok. Sometimes I'll, do, I'll, I'll make fun videos directly on the TikTok app, but a lot of the time I will use InShot. So that's a great tool to have and you can download that. I have the free version. Now, let's talk about um, what if you do not want to show your face? Uh, we talked about how powerful it is to show your face and you have an advantage, but there is things you can do if you don't want to show your face. That's fine. And there is some uh, really cool tools you can use. We're going to talk about that next. So the first thing you would want to maybe take advantage of is canva.com. So let's go over to Canva and I'll show you their stuff. Canva has a fantastic library of all kinds of video footage. So this is Canva. This is the free version. I'm going to hit, I'm going to create a design. I'm going to create a video. And then you can see here that a video template comes up. And then on the left here is all kinds of stuff you can put in your video. So going back to my example, let's say that I had a dog um, video that I wanted to make. You could search for dogs. Okay. Uh, if I want to search for more dog footage, some more dog footage, and some of these are the paid vert, like you'll have to pay for the uh, $15 a month for the pro uh, videos, but there's a lot of free content as well. And so I would just, so I could just select that. Okay. So you can make quick videos from canva.com. So it's a powerful tool. Okay. You can also put music to this. I can add music in this app. It's pretty cool. I can also add text. Um, I can instantly add any text that I wanted. So this is a great tool called canva.com. That's tool number one. The next tool to make faceless accounts would be pexels.com. 
Paxels, by the way, is spelled P-E-X-E-L-S. And all this free footage comes up and I can use any of this footage. Okay, and I can download it and I can use that. I can, use, I can upload this video footage to my Canva if I wanted to, okay? You can also go in, so let's go back to Canva. I could upload the Pexels. I could also upload YouTube videos that I've downloaded. You can, you can really mix and match all kinds of stuff in Canva. So it's a, it's a great, those are two great tools that I use for faceless at different levels. Okay, so there's that. Uh, you can also partner with a social creator. How you would do that is what you would, you approach people like say in our group, uh, you would say, hey, is there anyone who wants to make videos for me? I will do all the back end stuff. I'll set up the pages. I'll set up the Facebook pages or whatever. I'll do all the affiliate marketing technical stuff and you just make the videos. There is people that just love making the videos and they don't want to do the other stuff. So you could partner up with them. And there, there's tons of people like that in tons of Facebook groups. And you could just put a message out there saying, hey, is there anyone who wants to partner up with me and do an affiliate marketing business? I'll do all the... Um, I'll do all the back end stuff and you just do the, the videos and we'll split the profits type thing. You could also do that. I know that's a popular option as well. And of course, you can actually pay someone to do a lot of the stuff that I've been teaching you. You can go to Fiverr and you can find someone to post videos for you. So that's a lot of the faceless options. You can mix and match and take advantage of those. Now, my I recommend learning actually how to be a social creator because it's a powerful skill to have. And there's three references of people that I've learned from. And I used to be a terrible at making videos. You know, I'm okay. I'm not like amazing like some of these people, but I'm okay. But I've learned a lot from Joseph Todd. He's got a lot of great advice. Okay, that's someone I follow. I also follow this guy here, Lost LeBlanc. He has like 2 million followers. And he started out as just a guy with like 25 bucks in his pocket. He went to Thailand and he... um he started making videos and anyways, he blew up and he became this big social creator by, he teaches people how to be a social creator. So that's another guy you can learn from. He has a course. And then Erica as well, she's really good. She's a lawyer and her account really blew up too. And she monetized her YouTube and she teaches you how to uh, blow up your social media as well. So those are three people you can learn from. And they have, there's a ton of free stuff. I would watch all their free stuff to learn and learn as much as you can. And because being a social creator is power and you could virtually work from anywhere in the world if you can learn to become a good social creator. You can create social products and it's a great skill to have. And um, if you wanna speed things up, you can actually go to somewhere called FameSwap and you can buy an account. You can literally buy a valid TikTok, Instagram or YouTube account. This is what the big guys do. This is what the big companies do. When they want a social media following, they go and pay, um, buy a huge following. And there's different prices. Like some of these are pretty pricey, but you can get an account for as little as like $100. And uh, because you need at least a thousand followers to put your affiliate link in that TikTok account. So you could go and just, if you didn't want to wait to grow your account to a thousand followers, you could just go and buy an account. That would be an option as well. But of course, you it won't take long to get to a thousand followers if you consistently post every day. So that's just a bonus tip. If I had the money and wanted to speed things up, I would definitely buy an account next time if I were looking back to do this all again. Now in your videos, not only do you wanna make sure you have a awesome hook line, but you also wanna make sure you have an awesome call to action, okay? So a lot of people forget about this and just instead of saying, follow me for more at the end of your video, you wanna make sure you have something really strong, really compelling, you want them to go to a visit our profile link so they can go buy the product. So we wanna let them know that there's something there that they will like, that will solve their problem. And we wanna let them know that if they go and do that thing, they, they, it will fix it for them or we have something for them. So um, make sure that it's not just saying follow for more. So you get the idea, okay? And put that near the end of every video and um, you'll, be, you'll have a lot more visitors to your product. All right, recommended reading. For I would recommend reading The 10X Rule by Grant Cardone. It's a 15-minute read. He teaches you how to think bigger, get excited about your money goals, and uh, he talks about thinking too small. Don't make the mistake of thinking too small. And he really gets you excited about life, and he really helps you get think out of the box and think bigger. And uh, it's an exciting read, and it's uh, 15 minutes. And I wouldn't recommend reading it from front to back. 
I would just go through the headings, the topics that interest you the most. So scan through it and just read it in any order. You don't have to read it in any specific order. Just find the topics and chapters that really excite you. And that's how I, I read. Uh, I find readings a lot more enjoyable that way. And I read from several books at the same time. I'll read maybe one chapter from one book and then another chapter from another book one day and so on. Okay, so that puts the joy back into reading. So that's that's it for lesson three, and I will see you in lesson four. That's, bye for now.